Welcome back to your feel-good breakfast show, Express on SABC3. Now look, of course, we live in a world that is filled with technology where it's all just about making things smaller, from computer chips, smartphones, everything's just getting smaller and smaller and smaller. But check this out. Scientists in Israel have just made history by etching the 1.2 million letters of the Old Testament of the Bible onto a disc that is no larger than the tip of a pen. Yeah, that is Can you yeah. deal? Yeah. Can yeah. you yeah. deal? That is so wrong, man. Miniaturization, <laughs> it's called, okay? Look at that. Miniaturization. So what it is basically is they call it a nano Bible, meaning uh, reading it requires special equipment, like mm. an electron microscope. Teeny tiny text to experiment miniaturization. And uh, yeah, you can store it in very, very small places, I guess. Exactly. So basically, <laughs> you can also lose it very, very easily. quickly. <laughs> Listen, so, so if you want to know how they did it, here's a, here's a quick Roundup. Uh, so the scientists at the Technion uh, Israel Institute of Technology in Haifa created a layer of silicon less than 100 atoms thick. Okay, I don't know if I One surely understand that, but sure. <laughs> then they plated it with gold, all right? So they then used a focused ion beam to engrave the 1.2 million characters one at a time, blasting away the gold to reveal the darker silicon beneath. Yeah, in Do fact, you guys get that? It, well, it, it kind of is making hey? s uh, sense in a little bit, but yeah. if you want to read the text, you'll have to uh, magnify it by 10,000 times. I'm looking at that now, right? I read Hebrew. They left out the dots, which means it's easier to print. Ha, ha, ha. The dots? Yeah, so it, it should be a line. You see where it is now? Yes. And there's usually dots underneath to make you read easier. Oh, right. So they left all the nouns out, so it's probably easier to print. But it's, so if they left all the nouns out, how do you know like who's Abraham? It, though, well, you still spell it. It's still a word. Oh, okay, all right. But anyway, check out this. So the Bible is now on display as part of the uh, Israel Museum's 50th anniversary exhibition, and it sits oh. next to the Dead Sea Scroll. That it, is it, crazy. Uh, <laughs> it, it's in there. No. Imagine that, that. you're going on the tour and they're like, oh, and come and have a look at the Nano Bible, the smallest Bible in the world. And you're like, where? Where? <laughs> where? No, 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 it's right spot. there. It's right there. Where, where, where? <laughs> That's incredible. It is crazy. You sure. know what's also incredible? What? The fact that you have your pup on the table. No, there's nothing wrong. <laughs> Listen. This is a breakfast show, okay? We eat. <laughs> oh, no.